hey guys welcome back to my channel so today we are going to be doing at home waxing and this is a kit that i bought off of amazon i will link the product for you i think it was about almost 40 bucks but it comes with the waxer so what i'm going to do is i'm going to wax my armpits to see how this turns out i'm scared i'm not gonna lie but if you guys haven't done so already please uh subscribe hit that notification bell and we are gonna get started with this okay so i the wax is warm and then you take it out to make sure that it's like liquid so i'm gonna put it back in and this is my armpit i don't have like a crazy amount of hair but we're gonna try it just to see how it works so basically what you're gonna do is you're gonna wax in the area or in the direction of hair growth so my hair grows up so i'm gonna pull it this way and then once I apply the wax strip, I'm gonna have to pull it in the opposite direction. So I would put the wax strip and then pull it down. And then when you're doing it, I was like looking at videos and one girl did like this where she put her hand on her head um, just to kind of keep it and then flexed her arm. So just to make it easier because if you keep your arm like this, it's not gonna give you as much of a grip. So we are gonna try that now. So now I'm just peeling this little layer, I guess that's attached to it. And you can also test out the wax to make sure that it's like good. Another recommendation or another way that you can apply the wax is just applying it directly to the strip and then put the strip on whatever area of the body you want to wax. So, I mean, that makes a lot of sense too if it's just easier that way for you. I'm going to try to see if I can apply it on my actual armpit. I am going to test a strip just to see if it's... They said to test it to see if it um, comes out smoothly. So I actually put the wax on the strip i'm gonna try it like this to see if it might work i think it needs to be melted more but we're gonna just try it out so i put it on i'm rubbing it and then i'm gonna pull it down to see it is sticking i did not have powder unfortunately but we're gonna see how this works i'm gonna grab it and i'm gonna pull so i pulled out a few hairs I'm gonna let this heat up more and then I'm gonna try to um, to do it again. I think I'm gonna just spray it directly on though. Just I feel like it might be a little bit easier just to kind of spread it onto my armpit and then to take the strip and then pull. But it did take some hairs out, not too bad. But we're gonna wait and see. All right, so we're gonna try it the other way now. I'm gonna try to roll it on. So my hairs are growing up. So I think I'm gonna do it the same way I did it before. I'm gonna roll it on the wax strip just because I feel like rolling it on the skin itself hurts more than the wax strip. So we're gonna do it like that. We're gonna try to see. And also what I'm doing is I'm leaving space at the bottom so that I can pull. Because if you don't leave space, then you're not gonna be able to pull the wax. All right, so I put the wax on there and then I'm going to put it on. I'm gonna angle it a little bit. I'm not a professional tell you right now <laughs> i don't know what i'm doing this is my first time ever doing this so we shall see how it works out so i'm gonna pull it again now one two three <sighs> Ooh, that hurt it pulled out a lot more though like almost all of it is gone it just needs this bottom section and the bottom section my hairs grow a little bit this way so i'm gonna put more wax on this because you can use these multiple times so i'm gonna put some more wax on it to see if i can get the rest of the hairs honestly it doesn't hurt it hurts more trying to put the wax on your armpits than actually putting it on the paper and then putting it on your armpits. Just gonna, once again, I'm gonna put it this way. I don't know, like on a scale from one to 10, I guess depending on your, uh, on how well you take pain, I would say maybe like a six. It's not very painful because it's one quick movement. I actually tried an epilator before and that's way worse because you're like literally plucking each individual hair. One, two, that one hurt a little more but it's almost completely done i just have a few hairs but i also think my hairs weren't as long as they could have been um you know in regards to the waxings i know once i do it like more frequently i'll probably be able to get a better grasp and just do it like in one swoop instead of having to do multiple but overall i would say it definitely works i just like that with waxing you don't have to necessarily wait a short period of time for your hair to grow back like shaving i still have a few that i'm going to try to get rid of but for the most part my armpit is like 
pretty clear and I guess if you have some that you need to get rid of you might be able to just pluck them so it did pretty good it took the majority of my hairs out I think that's pretty good overall it's like red I don't want it to get irritated so I'm gonna use this wax removing emollient cotton which are these finishing wipes I'm gonna use this on my armpit just to get rid of any of the wax that I might have left over okay guys so this armpit was a test run it looks good now it the redness calmed down a little bit I did pluck whatever little bit of hairs were left so we're gonna try this one and this one's gonna be like legit legit wax strip saturated I'm gonna put it on this armpit I'm gonna angle it a little bit this way I feel like this one might hurt more because I am right-handed and now I have to pull with my left but we're gonna try it all right we're gonna pull it down and then the next time I do it I'm gonna pull it up one two three <sighs> wow Ooh, that burns <laughs> Oh, but it's like like the majority of the hair out. There's only like a little bit left. That was a good one. That was a good one. All right, we're gonna finish and I'll show you guys how my armpits look after. But I'm gonna just swipe, like try to do it up and then that'll be it, I think. Hopefully. This one hurt more though, honestly, than the other. I guess because I'm right hand, I'm left, I'm right handed. I'm not left handed, so. So this is how my armpits look after. I am completely satisfied. I will check to see how long it's gonna take for my actual hair to grow back, but I am definitely satisfied. I know once I do it a couple of times, I will get more of a gist of, you know, getting it in like maybe one or two swipes as opposed to having to do multiple, but I would highly recommend it. I will include the details of where to buy it down below. Um, off of Amazon and I am part of the Amazon Associates so if you do uh, purchase or decide to purchase this item um, please purchase through the link because I do also earn commission from the purchases and I would definitely recommend it I think it's great I think it's really convenient if you're tired of shaving and you want just like an easy way to get rid of your hair for like an extended period of time, I think it's a great option for people who want to wax instead of shaving. And I think it's really convenient. I do find it much easier to put it on the wax paper than to actually put it on your arm because it can tug at your skin and it kind of hurts. So if you are gonna use it, I would say to, for one, way more than 20 minutes, it needs to be heated up for. I would say mine was there for maybe like 40, 45 minutes um, in order for the wax to get really wet or really soft. And I would definitely recommend also just spreading it on the sheet that you're gonna be using because it just made it so much more easier to, and. I would say cleaner it just made it so much easier to just put it on the strip put the strip on your armpit rub it and then pull as opposed to me tugging at my skin because that I feel like could cause more irritation um, so I would definitely highly recommend it I will like I said include everything for you guys and I want to thank you guys for watching if you have any questions please link them down below and don't forget to like this video and give it a thumbs up I'll see you guys in my next video thanks bye